Hello, welcome to a brief tutorial on using What Works for Health. What Works for Health is a tool developed by experts at the University of Wisconsin Population Health Institute with funding from the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation. You can use What Works for Health to search for strategies to improve health in your community. I will be providing you with some brief guidance on using the What Works for Health website. So let's go to the website. Here we are at the What Works for Health website. You can look for strategies by selecting a health factor of interest in our model, such as tobacco use, education, or access to health care. For example, let's select community safety. We now have a list of strategies that address community safety. This list is based on our review of a wide variety of research. We assign the evidence ratings based on the research we find. Strategies with the strongest evidence appear first. Those with less evidence appear later. The minus sign next to community safety shows that we are only looking at strategies for this health factor. To see the full listing of community safety strategies, we can use the navigation at the bottom of the page. We can also narrow our list to strategies that could be implemented by a specific decision maker. For example, we'll select healthcare professionals. Now you see a shorter list of strategies. To go back to the full list, we can click on the minus sign. Similarly, if we're interested in a particular evidence rating, we could narrow our list by selecting that rating. Clicking on the title of a strategy brings us to more detailed information about that strategy. Let's select Early Childhood Home Visitation Programs. We see a short description of the strategy at the top of the page. The evidence rating is indicated by the thermometer on the side. Hovering over the thermometer shows more information about each evidence rating. Scrolling down, you'll see a summary of the evidence supporting each strategy, likely impact on disparities, and implementation examples and resources to help you take action. Clicking the plus sign next to citations provides more detailed information. We can return to the full list of strategies in What Works for Health by selecting Policies and Programs in the breadcrumbs at the top of the page. Another way to search for a specific strategy or topic is to use the keyword search. For example, we'll type Community Garden. You can also use quotation marks to find exact matches. Finally, you can learn all about how we assign evidence ratings, the sources we use, and how to use these ratings in decision making by returning to the What Works for Health landing page. Thank you for visiting What Works for Health. We hope that What Works for Health is a valuable resource to you as you begin to identify strategies toward making your community a better place to live, learn, work, and play. Thank you.